Hi everyone. I hope you are having great day today and welcome back to my new video. On this tutorial, I'm going to show you Feather app with no revoke to install, IP files on iPhone and iPad. As you know, the Feather app is here to overcome crashes for Scarlet and Assign users. Assign often crashes on iOS 18. By using the Feather app, you can install IP files such as Assign and Scarlet without crashes and run smoothly on all iOS versions. Here I will share for free how to install the Feather app along with anti-revoke DNS so you can use the Feather app for a longer time. First of all, go to website featherapp.bio.link. I created this website and collected several working certificates and anti-revokes for the Feather app. You can try several Feather links on this website and try installing them one by one. First step, you have to install DNS anti-revoke for Feather app. Install DNS and click Allow. After that, install DNS on setting. Click Profile Downloaded. Input the passcode. Then click Install. This DNS is useful for bypassing certificates that have been revoked by Apple, so you can use the certificate in Feather even though the certificate has been revoked. After DNS is installed, then install the Feather app link available on this website. You can try the links from above first and try them one by one. You will be redirected to installing Feather, but you have to skip this short link. Please complete the mission on your screen. Like in this video, I will watch a video for a few seconds, then return to the short link website, then click unlock content. you will automatically be redirected to installing the Feather app. Click Open and Install. Then the Feather app will automatically be installed on your device. If you see Untrusted Developer, it means the Feather app link worked on your device. But if you see Unable to Verify, you have to try another link until you see Untrusted Developer. If Untrusted Developer appears on the Feather app, please verify it first. Go to Settings, General, VPN and Device Management. Then click Trust on Feather app. Now you can open the Feather app normally. But now you can't use the Feather app because you haven't imported the certificate into Feather. Go to the Settings section in Feather, then click Add Certificate. You need a certificate file first. Please return to the website earlier, then click Download Certificate. Make sure you try the certificate on the top page first. After downloading the certificate successfully, please go in and open the certificate. Then uncompress the zip file. After uncompressing, now you can import the certificate in Feather. You can see the certificate password in the folder that you have uncompressed. Open the Feather app, then add the certificate you downloaded earlier. Please add P12 and mobile provision files to Feather. You can see the certificate password in the folder that you have uncompressed. After the certificate has been successfully added to Feather, now you can install the IP of files or add the IP a source library to Feather. You can directly add URLs or IP of files and install them with Feather without revoke. Here I will try to install the IP of file that I have prepared and install it with Feather. You can search for the IP of files you need on the internet. Here I will install the IP a Misaka app on my iPhone. After you select IP a please click the app icon, then click sign. 
Then the IPA will be signed with the certificate you added earlier. After that, click the app icon again and click install. Then automatically the IPA you want to install will be installed automatically on the home menu. Wait a few moments until the installation process is complete. After that, you can use the app as usual and this Feather tutorial with Anti-Revoke is successful in installing IP of files on iPhone and iPad. Okay, thanks for watching this video. If you need a help, please leave your comment below or you can join to our discussion telegram group to get help. See you on the next video.